okay so you guys yeah so these are some of the most or frequently asked questions to women mm-hmm. in science or actually people in science in general what is what does science really mean to you what excites you about science like what is that one big word that you associate with science okay so i would describe science as a solution so this is very interesting question thank you for asking me so science means solution so even it is natural or man made so it is revolving to make our day and night right till uh till you till the man made the rocket wala so that is also as a solution for something else right so everything is happening naturally or man made i would say it is a solution for something else that is how even in atom bomb we came up with the the ideology that to meet the india's energy crisis we came up with the energy efficient plan so that is a solution for this one you oh, are nice yeah. Interesting question, Singha. So, if you, if somebody was to make was to make a movie on you, who would you like to play you in real life? Like from a student in mechanical engineering to this quality control expert in Atom Bomb. Okay, so I think if there will be a movie on me, if uh, I would like to play the lead, because if, I know you have to select one. You can't if, do that. <laughs> Allowed in any answer, you'll have to select one. Uh, and say Bollywood, no, thoda some Bollywood actress. Mm. anyone can do it but maybe uh, alia bhat uh, because her journey from student of the year till her recent movie i've seen her grow hmm. so okay and you gonna feel that was to happen to you <laughs> okay so personally i like deepika very much deepika padukone the pata pass for yeah nice okay so last question uh to both of you actually what's this one trend that you see picking up inside like what is it that you think that would really inspire women uh young women of today to take up science because there's a lot of deterrence that they have you know because it's a it has a longer gestation period it returns after a while you know there's a lot of again casual sexism involved in all of that and so what is it that you know what are the trends that you think women would should be really excited or young women should enter science so i think uh, internet of things iot is uh, one of the fields uh, that has a lot of potential to that we can work you want to plug in atom bomb right now and say yeah, what i have so, so just like our atom bomb <laughs> that uh, that we can control through smartphones voice control is there and many more uh, automations uh, we are planning to do in future also so i think it is a field that has a lot of potential to explore you can you want to give one message to like young girls out there and tell them why they should really pick this up they were uh, trying that girls should not uh, go for a mechanical engineering but mm. now it has been uh, the trend has been like started like you no know, uh, girls can get into mechanical field uh as so i'm just like you no know, uh, looking at the time period what we have so at my time nobody was nobody studied mechanical engineering now the trend has been full so if you uh, you have to go uh, search a lot in the internet about like you no know, job opportunities like what is the world is going on because there are like you know, mechanical is not you just go and uh, uh, do some work in the production field as a such like there are like different uh, categories are there uh, right from the design and advanced design everything you can do internet or go so that is a trend i i would like the uh, like uh, coming girls like they can follow so take up things that they didn't yeah. ever think of taking up yes. before because it yes. was never even it was never an option for them yeah. either even i would say like one case in my um, personal life my sister she did a petroleum engineering oh wow okay uh, so at that time so again it was a there, there was not a trend that was not catching up so now the trend has like catched up like petroleum engineers can go into design field right. designing the pipelines as a such so there are like many much more opportunities where girls also can work Right. Because I also can um, uh, reveal their knowledge as well. So that they have to really find it out. They have to explore more. They have to talk to many people to find it out actually what it is. Adding to that, uh, me and my sister, we both are mechanical engineers. I like how both of you plug in your family also along with that. So, so we can actually <laughs> see that the society is changing. Right. Oh, your sister is also mechanical yeah. engineer. Okay, sorry. I know I said last question, but I think I missed one very interesting question. Is uh, and again to both of you, what is like the stupidest question you've been asked as a woman in science? Like the one question which makes uh-huh. you cringe. He, why? Like why is it such a tip? Or just as a woman in general, like you know, a woman, a career woman actually. Career woman. Okay, so um, I'm not. Uh, so okay, actually, I have 
gone through two two questions like this. When I said about food technology, as I've already mentioned that I deal food technology, many people they thought okay, scattering. So it's a oh, oh, really oh, wow. Okay. Yes. Oh, oh, you did food technology, so which means you cook very well. So their knowledge, their their uh, knowledge about the food technology is just like cooking, cooking. But you want to smash the theory and say you know you can't cook well, but you are very good at your own work. Yeah. I was like so pissed off. Okay, it's not catering. Right. Food technology dealing with the science of food. Right. And one more question which I um, already uh, come up with. Okay, you are food technology. What are you doing with the appliances company? What okay. is your role in the appliances company? Right. You should have gone for the food R and D or something production or uh, food safety or something. What are you doing with the appliances? Right. And again, we need to. I need to explain them. Okay, okay. This is what happening. So at the end of the day, we are just dealing with the food. Food is only going into the appliances. So what happened to the food? Correct. So why it is being processed? Why it has to come into this texture? So this is what a science behind. Like just connecting food and the appliances. So I need to explain it then again and again. So these are the two stupid, quite stupid questions. I need to come. Yeah, same. Uh, so for me, uh, right from the time I made the decision to be a mechanical engineer till now, I've been as this: Why do you want to be a mechanical engineer? Why do you want to do an on-field job? So that is. But have you not heard like very stupid questions like, "Are you going to be a mechanic, or can you fix my refrigerator, oh, or things yeah, like that?" Yeah, that is also like you are an engineer, fix this, fix that. <laughs> <laughs> but have you ever tried doing that? I have not for other people, but for myself. And has that worked out? At times, yes. At <laughs> Don't times, tell that to no. people. <laughs> but thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much for this.